There's two things I hate in this world. One, bullies. Two, League of Legends. I was told that this show has nothing to do with the game. It takes elements. It, it, it's about the game, but it's not at the same time. You could just watch the show and not play the game. If I had to play the game to watch this show, I wouldn't be on camera right now. But for you guys, I am your own personal slut, so I'll do whatever you want me to do. If you want me to continue Arcane, get this video to 10,000 likes, which is definitely a lie, because I'm still gonna continue to show regardless if this video gets 10,000 likes or not. It's just a YouTube thing. Like the video, subscribe. But yeah, I'm excited. It's in English, and it's Netflix. Two things I never thought I'd react to on this channel. Let's get to the video. That's so weird. I usually hate Netflix shows, so I'm hoping this changes my mind on Netflix. I'm hoping this is good. Praying this is good. Praying! Holy shit! Let me just say this before we continue. The theme, the editing, phenomenal. And I love how, like, like, destructive it is so far. Like, this little girl is singing. I'm guessing to, to block out what's the destruction that's happening in front of her. It looks like they're escaping a city that was just destroyed or something by a robot. It looked like, it's probably not a robot, I don't know. But, who knows? It's probably God. But it looked like an older person was holding her, guiding her through this destruction. It, just the editing, the colors. Even the singing was, was like, like I was watching a horror film. Like I was afraid. I'm afraid of dolls, okay? I don't know why this reminded me of a doll singing, but this, this is fucking creepy and I'm, I'm liking this. So far, so far. Nick, you, you love everything. Ooh, that transition into music to signify that this guy's good, I'm guessing. It looked like he just took out the thing that killed someone. And she has purple hair and they have red and blue hair, so I'm guessing they were related. Are they like the colored pencils? Why am I joking around? This is beautiful. Wow. Wow, man. If y'all don't know, I am a slut for music. And this is next level already. That orchestra, the emotion in it. Fuck! So they're not robots, they're like in uniform. Oh shit! I fucking hate Riot Games, but goddamn, that was an introduction. It reminded me of Death Note. Death Note just brought me in with that introduction, like it set up the show. And this, I felt like, just set up the entire show. Like, these two characters, or these three characters, are gonna be the main characters. And the whole show is gonna be about what just happened. Like, her getting revenge for whoever just died. Her older sister, or mother, or just maybe someone that adopted, or whatever. I mean, it's called Orphaned Sisters. Vi and Powder. So I'm guessing that was her parents, her mom that was dead, that got shot by the soldier. Phenomenal. The editing is unique. The music, that orchestra, and the art style is just, wow. It's different. I don't even know what D it is. Two, three, four, seven, seven D? Who knows? All I know is it's enlarging my D, so. This is a fucking intro. So this is the red hair. Almost there. It, this has to be like 10 years later. Yeah, yeah, definitely. They're both older. They're dealing with that that grief from when they were children now. Hey, Powder. Now they're old enough to take action. Finally. They are here! Yeah! I think that's the city that we're looking at. Beautiful, holy. Mother of God Linda. in the Pacific. Look, if we get caught, we're, we're gonna get caught. All right, so you have the rebellious girl with the red hair. You have the little girl that's following in her older sister's footsteps. You have the rebellious guy that just wants to destroy everything. And then you have the pussy that's just gonna be afraid of everything, but he's gonna turn out to have an amazing arc like Armin in Attack on Titan. That's what you're telling me. Did I just put it together right? If I did, let me know down below. This is like me and my old friend group. Just doing stupid shit for no reason. Jumping on top of buildings. We gotta stay out of sight for this one. This art style is so different. It's like painted. I'll get it. No. Her. Powder, look at me. 
That's how you raise a kid. Face your problems. Don't be a pussy. Imagine she dies in the first episode. I already saw a picture of her older, so I know she lives. Unless she cracks her head on the floor right now and dies, then I don't know. Oh, this kid's definitely gonna piss me off. The sort of job Vander would have pulled when he was our age. I'm guessing Vander is the guy that saved them when Are they were kids. The so they look up the Vander. Who locks their balcony? Who locks their balcony? If you live in Brooklyn, you definitely lock everything. Even the microwave. The one who knows how to pick locks, I suggest. <laughs> Oh, I love her. There's a lot of clock medieval theme going on with this show right now. So I'm guessing they're dead broke. When you're broke, bro, you'd be surprised what you do. It's like a hungry animal. You'll eat your own brother if you have to. They think this is a real Valdiani. The voice act is pretty good. It's not cringy. Oh, yeah. That's a nose hair trimmer. But I don't think that guy uses that as a nose hair trimmer. It's probably an ass hair trimmer. Little man? Little man. Imagine being called little man. It's like calling him little dick. I don't want to be called that. She's gonna discover something now that's gonna be show changing. She's alone. She's opening this chest that looks like it shouldn't be opened. Is it the Chaos Emerald? Yeah, y'all, y'all taking your time. Get the fuck out already. <laughs> she took all of them. Oh my god. Holy fuck. You're gonna level the building? Holy shit, I feel like my, my apartment's collapsing right now. That uh, that sound engineering is just, whoo. Shit. I love that this cursing. So this isn't a little bit show. Good. Curse, bring the blood. Right oh my god, I thought he threw a grenade at him. I'm like, what kind of city is this? This is blood rushing. You feel like you're in this scene with the music, like you're running with them, like you're trying to escape. Damn, these kids are rebels, man. I'm liking that. Hell yeah. For a second, I thought they were throwing Pokeballs at them. I'm like, am I watching the right show? Yeah, I just got this shirt. Oh, I would never. I'd rather get whipped. Nailed on a cross. Fill a damn library with all the things you didn't do. Guys. Oh. We just emptied I want to beat the shit out of him right already. Under the enforcer's noses. He's already pissing so, me off. Let's get this home. I love her attitude. Smart. She's not stupid. Damn, this is really the slums. No, I, I I knew they were poor, but that. I heard there was some <laughs> This ain't poor, this river. is Poe. Oh, I hate people. <laughs> this is why I don't go outside. But you're tracking this mess of yours through my streets. Would you really brag about these being your streets? Like, I don't know about you, but these don't even look like streets. They look like, like, cracks. Just... <laughs> <laughs> yes! Whoa! Okay! He ain't a pussy after all. Oh. God, bro. Bro, look at this shit. That dude is a tank. I wouldn't be chasing after her, bro. She has the she has the chaos emeralds in her bag. This is like real fighting. What? <laughs> yeah, hey! She's a badass! Holy mother of Pearl! She's out for the kill! She's my idol. She's probably 13. I don't give a fuck. She, I want to be her when I grow up. Wanna see how that ends? <laughs> oh! Yo! Where's Powder? Oh, she's so good. She's like a little girl. I'm so... I feel so bad. Is she gonna throw that fucking grenade at him? She named her bomb? I did not see that coming. There goes that whole, that heist, the diamond heist. Forget about it. At least you're okay. Oh, okay. She's the cutest. About, uh, I get my face bashed in and she just gets a pass? Yep. <laughs> oh, shit. They're going to the bad cave? Yeah, she jinxes every job. Uh, oh, kid. Kid, shut up. Shut up. 
right now. Power to look at look at look at the little mean face. Oh my god! Who told you what was I'm not even gonna say it. You already know what I'm gonna say. So music aside, which I definitely have to mute for copyright issues, most likely. Look at this, these shots, man. Like you have to be on some crazy ass drug to even create these things. Oh, oh hey. Wait, is that how fast he was? He literally just went in there. Six, seven, eight. Eight seconds, bro, come on. Even I go longer than 15 seconds at least. Oh shit, that's uh, Vendor. Vandor. V I don't know what his name is. Suppose that concludes our business then. You don't do business with people that look like that. It does. I'm sorry. I'm a very judgmental person. If you look like that, I'm not doing business with you. I think you should take it. Yeah, yeah. I wouldn't argue with this guy. You folks need anything? You fucks need anything? Did he say? Fox or folks? You folks need anything? Folks, okay. <laughs> I think I know what you need. You don't, oh. think you don't threaten the guy who pours the drinks. <laughs> so, okay, Daddy. We were expecting traders who would honor their word. So I guess we're all disappointed. <laughs> oh. all Vendor, Vendor, B Bob, please shoot them in the faces. They're ridiculous now. Have a deal. Ooh, I love his voice actor. It's intimidating with that accent. Oh, Welcome God. To the They're going to get whipped now with the belt. Vander learns none of this. No worries there. <laughs> Probably knows already. I don't suppose you can explain why it is that I'm hearing about an explosion and a foot chase <laughs> topside? Stop to think about what could have happened to you. Hey, eh? To them? I took us there. If you want to be mad, be mad at me. We stay out of Piltover's business. Why? They've got... When did you get so comfortable living in someone else's shadow? You feel this fight. It's like a, a father and a daughter fighting. The daughter trying to be like her father, but she sees that he's not like that anymore. He's trying to make a better life for her, but she doesn't want that. She wants to be like him. And then you have these conflicting personalities, but they're so alike. Incredible, the voice acting. It, feel, it feels like a real fight between a father and a daughter. When people look up to you, you don't get to be selfish. You say run, mm. they run. You say light a fire, they show up with oil. Shit. The dialogue. Spitting facts. So it's, this, it's not going to solve your problems. Mm. It just makes more. The relationship, you already so feel it. Oh, you did put that idiot on his ass, though. Right? <laughs> Yes! Dude, these characters are so cool so far. I'm not too crazy about them yet, but they're like the Get side, on, the friends. I think you should know better than to come back from a job empty-handed. I'm gonna have a little word with I'm you. I'm about to start calling him dad. She's so cute. I feel so bad. Of course. Is she gonna keep this from everyone now, or is she gonna reveal it? She made a mistake. Name one time she has. She's young. There's a bunch of things Powder just can't do. Oh my god. Why'd you say that at that moment in time? Oh no, she's not mean about everything. She's not gonna hear the rest of the conversation. Powder's my problem. Okay, your problem is never knowing when to shut up. But oh ready this look on my face? This will always mean it's time to shut up. I won't talk either. Wow. She's a badass. Echo! What's going on with that thing? Echo. Isn't Echo one of like the Heroes or champions or whatever in, in, in um, League of Legends. Off you go. <laughs> so cool. You're a little early. The whole setting. Well, guys, I can't get enough of this. Uh, they're growing up, Vanda. Looking to write their own stories. Wow. The dialogue. I can't get enough of this. Everything is like A plus so far. Story, dialogue, music, setting. How did you find that place? I, just... Whoa. Did you I can't tell him? if this kid is 10 or 30. I just don't know. His voice, and I, I just don't know. He paid in gold and didn't even haggle. I charged him double price. Hell yeah! Whoever's raising him, you're raising him right. Oh shit. Look at him wearing gas masks. Pussies. Oh my god. I'm not gonna like the government in this show either, aren't I? <laughs> He's like, ugh. But you already knew that. This dude definitely gets his balls tickled that night. Oh, do you go for a little walk, Marcus? Yeah, get this pussy out of here. Dude looks like he sucks toes. Don't mind him. 
doesn't know when to pipe down. But what a voice! Workshop belonged to the Kermans. You know what kind of stuff they had in there? Council needs someone to make an example of. People oh. need to feel safe. Yeah. <laughs> Woo -hoo. That voice acting, man. They, they did it right with this. She seems like a good enforcer, a good cop. How serious this is. If I don't put someone behind bars tonight. Sorry, Grayson. You think he's gonna sell out his child? That would be some next level shit. I feel like my dad would be like, you know what? Yeah, it's my son, Nick. I'll give you his last name, his date of birth, his social security number. It was him. And only me. That's gonna be used sometime in this season. Definitely. This first episode setting up a lot. A lot of interesting directions this could go. With that blue orb, the trouble, the beginning. What are you Look at her cute con contraptions. What's the point? It ruined everything. Oh. No. no. You heard them. I'm not a fighter. Come with me. What? She's such a badass, Come but on. she has that like older sister motherly dynamic with her with, her, with the little kid. It's so cute. What are we doing here? Her voice. See that oh, around? this show is beautiful. I wish I was sitting there right now. Enforcers. I wouldn't be balancing the on that when I'm drunk. They left him there. Why? Why are you pissing? Why? We found him. That sign. You see it? Huh? His ass made that splotch. This storytelling is so good. When I was a kid, some guy took my favorite toy and threw it up there. I used to come out here at night, stare at it, hoping maybe the wind or a bird might knock it down. My bad days. We I'm in awe. Together. I'm in awe of what I'm watching right now. These were in my pocket. She got more? I thought she only took one. Should we show Vander? No. Oh, show anyone. <laughs> Let's keep this our little secret. Ah. Uh, You're stronger than you. Uh, fuck Milo. This city's gonna respect us. Oh! Woo! Yep. I'm definitely gonna continue watching this show. Oh, I thought it was over. These ain't 20 minute episodes, it's like 40 minutes. <laughs> Oh, so he's hired by someone. Now his accomplice is asking questions. Wow! That's a villain voice! Explosion in the upper city! That was them. Yeah. Vanders in trouble. Holy crap! Best thing you ever said. I have chills, man. Our timeline has moved up. It's almost ready. Look at the little rat. Wait, what did they do with the rat? Oh no, I don't want to see this. Not the rat. Don't tell me they're gonna show this. No, no. Someone just volunteered. So now I know why you wanted me to react to this all, all this time. I know now. I, I can't even praise this enough this first episode. The theme, the music, the characters, the storytelling, the dialogue. The dialogue. Wow. Some things they say in the show just straight out of my, my yearbook. Like, just incredible. It's a genius. The animation is just so unique, like painted. And, and it, it's so like lore heavy. Th there's no emptiness. Everything looks well thought out. When Vi was talking to Powder on the roof, explaining like, you see that? You see this? You see that? I love things like that. It's just that storytelling element. It adds that emotion. And she's like the older sister, the badass, that's, that's trying to raise Powder. And Powder's just a little kid. She feels useless, but she said one day this city's gonna respect us. I love that. That was dope. And Vandor is just so cool. It's like he is the leader of the underground, kind of. So we can't be so, like how we used to be, how we saw him in the first minute of the show, like this this killer and shit. But I feel like we're gonna see him in, in like God mode one day soon. Um, the two friends, Milo and. 
the other kid. Milo is going to piss me off more and more, I know that. But I know I'm probably going to end up liking him. And the other kid, I can't remember his name. I'm not going to go back. I want to keep this natural. Who else? Um, the enemy at the end. The voice acting is incredible. You knew it was a, a villain right away. The kids hired by that villain to get intel, kind of, in the underground. And now it's all connected. The blue orbs, how does this tie into everything in the grand scheme of things? Who'd they rob? They said he was an inventor. Who are these inventors? Do they invent every... I mean, obviously they invent stuff, but like, what do they invent? The government people, the, the something, I forgot their names already. But um, I'm not going to remember everything, it's the first episode. They seem like there's going to be a lot of corruption within it. But there's going to be those good cops, like how it is in real, real times. That lady cop seems very nice. Like she was just doing her job. She wants to do it right. But yeah, they made a deal with Vandor to, you know, to keep peace by not letting things escalate, not letting them these these poor people get up there and cause a ruckus. I like that. Cool, cool dynamic right there. But yeah, guys, I'm broke. I sound like a broken record now. I always say this, but I'm loving this. This is sick. It doesn't take much to impress me, but I'm very impressed. It takes a lot to impress me a lot. And this impressed me a lot. Everything. Anyways, what'd you guys think when you first saw the show? Were you latched on? Did you get connected with it right away like I was? Or did it take you a few episodes to get with it? Let me know down below. But other than that, 